Let me know when you're ready. Okay, I'm good. Yeah. Okay. Both narrative and documentary, they are all like devices of telling stories. When I came to the United States, I was 26, and I had no idea uh, what I would be doing in my career. I took a documentary class. That was the first time I saw a documentary, because in China, documentaries are not the medium that we are allowed to see. Mostly on TV, documentaries are about Chinese landscape and magnificent history and food. So that's what I thought documentary was until, until I saw a documentary here. That was when I realized that documentaries could be about social issues and characters and then compelling stories and have actually narrative arc. And that was when I told myself this is something I wanted to do and never thought that I was going to become a filmmaker. My first film actually started as my thesis film and then ended up premiering at Sundance and got shortlisted for the Academy Awards. I had not thought that would happen. When I came to the US, I had the hope that I was going to study journalism so I could go back to China to report the injustice that I saw when I was there, when I grew up. When I was pregnant with my first child, I noticed that within that week, my perspective had changed. I became very protective. I wanted the child to have a safe life. So I asked my mom, what it was like for you when you were pregnant? So my mom started telling me about all the things that she witnessed when she was pregnant, which was under the one-child policy. China limited every couple to have only one child. I heard so many things and it shocked me and motivated me to find out what happened during the one-child policy, which lasted more than 35 years in China. And that's why I started making this film. The stories from different countries, different language and different era, uh, they all had impact on me. I cared about the people, and because they are real people, so it made me care about their issues. That's when I thought, this is the perfect medium if I wanted to tell a story, and hopefully the story would have some positive effect on the society. Documentary, to me, I think, is the medium that could show people a place, a culture that you've never been to, you've never thought about, or you have different assumption. Now you are seeing them um, for the first time and understand them better. Then that's the real change would start happening. The first and most important thing is to know what you want to do in life and to find that passion. Once you realize that, the next thing is go ahead and do it because there will be many challenges in every field, whether it's filmmaking or something else. But if you have the passion and the perseverance, eventually you will get there. <laughs>